So, hi YouTube. Now, ma many of you guys probably don't know, but YouTube is making a movie. It says, I'm going to say for YouTube to gather videos for life, life in a day movie. So basically, it's about, we submit, us YouTubers, submit clips of us doing things every day. Um, so yeah, I'm going to read it to you. And if you don't want to listen to it, you can probably, I'll put an annotation for you to like, what's, what, what time is it I stop, I stop talking about it. If you just want to hear about what, what you have to do. Okay, so, New York. With the help of director Kevin McDonald, producer Riley Scott, and a few hundred other filmmakers, YouTube is making a movie. YouTube is owned by Mountain View, Calif California-based Google Inc. It is organized the creation of Life in a Day. A project that plans to document July 24th with submitted videos from around the world. YouTube is asking people to upload footage of their daily lives. McDonald, the last king of Scotland, state of play, the movies he's done, serves as director and will, will edit together the feature-length documentary from the submitted material. Scott, he did the guy who did Gladiator and Robin Hood, will produce. I hope it will be something that will open people's eyes to the possibilities of user-generated film, McDonald said. Of course, it's a risk. It could be that I won't get anything interesting back, but I don't think that will be the case. I'm sure there will be some real gems, some ma some real magic, which is what I'm looking for. So, so far right now, it's just saying that they're going to do a video and we can submit clips by July 24th. The film will premiere at the Sunday the Sundance Film Festival in January, which is January 2011. Um, it will simultaneously, simultaneously be streamed on YouTube for free. Those whose footage makes it into the film will be credited as co-directors and 20 of them will be flown to the Sundance for performance. Oh, I dropped my necklace. The project mirrors YouTube to previous crowd searching efforts to marry its enormous community with the professionals. Of course, as many of you YouTubers know, the reason we make these videos is to be famous, be in movies, to pursue our career. And that's what it's doing. So there's a lot more to read, and I'm going to read it to you guys, so I'm going to finish. I'm going to try to make it fast. Um, the YouTube System Orchestra gathered in class musicals from YouTube with the help of conductor Michael Tillerson Thomas and composer Tan, Dum, Tan Dunn. The recently launched YouTube Play partners with the Grudgeno Museum to create a biannual, biennial, I don't know the word, of creative video. We really feel that YouTube over the past five years has definitely changed the way that contact is created and consumed, said YouTube film and annotation maker. Sarah Polak, each of these programs continues to deliver against the empowering regular people who have visions, who have voices, who have the opinions, who have talent. McDonald's has as experts the, f the film to be kind of time of a time capsule. The filmmaker whose credit also includes the mountain climbing documentary Touching the Void said he particularly inspired by the 1930s, 1940s British documentary film Humphrey Jennings. McDonald made a 2000 documentary about Jenkins, who co-founded the Mass Observation, observation move, Movement, which sought the record everyday life by turning several hundred diaries into a book. It's not a mainstream film I'm going to make. It's an ex-potential film, McDonald said. I don't think that everybody can write a great novel. And I can't paint a great picture. But in the in, in this instance, people can contribute to what I hope is going to be a great film by giving something to themselves. Such a global inspiration oh enterprise could such a global enterprise could be difficult on a number of counts. The least of which might be managing the married language that will be spoken in the videos. Users must be at least 13, so this is what qualifies you to be in the video. You have to be 13 years old. And it can be from anywhere can be from anywhere except those countries restricted by the USA expert controls. No idea what that means. Contributors will also have a week to upload their videos to YouTube. 
which means some could send videos not shot on July 24th, so they have to be shot before that. Paul X said they are working under the honor code. Um, yeah, so that's it. So, and basically, YouTube's making a video. You can submit it to them. I don't know where or how. You submit it to them. It'll be 13, and it's be on by July 24th. Um, I'm gonna submit myself. You have to film yourself what you do as a daily routine, like something you do every day, all day, I guess. Me, I make videos, so I try to make videos every day of the summer, so maybe I'll do that, or maybe I'll do it about something I do every day, like just a day in my life. I guess that's what it has to do, just a day in your life. Do, just record you for a day. And I guess that's as good as it goes. I'll keep you updated. Um, you go to my channel for more information. I'll upload videos about this when I find out more information. So yeah, thanks for watching, and um, yeah, I'm live, I'm live on Blind TV. Ooh, there's an ant. What? There's an ant right there. How long did that take me to read that?